Oh man, I didn't even realize there were this many credits. Hey Internet, I'm Colorful Artie, and welcome to Lemmings Revolution. I was... Oh, oh wow, okay, this is where the game's credits are. Yeah, uh, basically, I've had, I played Lemmings Revolution, like, after I was playing the first Lemmings, but before I beat it. And I've wanted to let's play it. I've never actually beaten this game, because it gets really, really weird and hard at the end. But I f I'm pretty confident I can beat it now that I've beaten all these uh, custom-made Lemmings packs. It also plays uh, kind of differently from the other Lemmings games, so that'll be interesting. And opening movie. Come on. The weasels played a trick on us. They like to watch our old adventures. Lemmings was in theaters? Well, they like to watch us get hurt. Apparently they liked it. Eventually we found our promised land and colonized every corner. Some of us settled in the forest, others in the deserts, and even in the snowy wilderness. We mined the lands for their precious stones. We had no worries. Until, Until plot happened. <laughs> we were captured. The weasels imprisoned us in boxes whilst they set to work. Planting traps, puzzles, and pitfalls for their own entertainment. The weasels were building a bigger challenge for us lemmings. Yep. The weasels think it's all a big joke. Oh, I mean, they're tired of watching we the same thing on TV. Very funny. We've got to get out of here. Yep, great opening movie there. And also... I've kind of uh, realized, uh, watching that again, it's almost like we on the Lemmings forums are the weasels in this situation, because the weasels and, uh, basically are like, uh, we're getting bored, we want to make the Lemmings go through all these like uh, puzzles again, and on the Lemmings forums, we're like, yeah, let's make all these crazy hard level packs for the Lemmings, it's like, ugh, there's a lot of parallels there, but yeah, this is Lemmings Revolution, so we're gonna hit start new game, Yes, we're gonna start. So, this is kind of the level select for the game, where it's not linear, where it's like, you'll beat this level, you'll unlock this, and then this. You beat, like, this level, you unlock this, and this. So technically, you can get through the game without having to beat every level, but I'm gonna try to beat every level. So let's start with Just Climb. I really hope everything goes right with the recording, because something unexpected could happen. The loading times are a bit annoying in this. So this is kind of the main uh, gimmick of Lemmings Revolution, where everything's on like a giant cylinder, and you can turn it around like this. So, sometimes it'll just be like a regular Lemmings level, but sometimes it'll be like, oh, you can overlap from like going from the right all the way back to the left. So this is a pretty simple level. Just make the Lemmings climbers. Also, we don't have any of the fancy Neo Lemmings tools. Like, I mean... You should be lucky to have a speed up button, to be perfectly honest. You're lucky to be able to pause in this game. So no frame advance. No, I don't think you can assign skills while paused. Maybe you can. But yeah, there's no frame advance. I don't think there's even hotkeys, really. So this should be interesting. Less precision. Yep, get to the hot air balloon and it takes off. Level completed! Yeah! You totally stormed that level! Yeah! So if we hit continue, you'll notice, yeah, we unlocked the two levels in front of that. So this will be an interesting series, I believe. I'm really hoping the loading times will get a bit better. Let's do just float. This is pretty much exactly like fun in level two. Let's go! Also, Lemmings Revolution is pretty boss music, and that's the release rate you can adjust. You can't always adjust it to 99, though. We'll be encountering water more in later levels. And yeah, this game had one-way down arrows before Neo Lemmings did, I just remembered that. 
I'm not sure if you can mine from the road. Okay, good. You can't still assign fortress at the end of a fall. Oh, good. At least the level completed screen loads a lot faster now. <laughs> yeah, we totally stormed that level. Just bomb. Oh, yay! Walking bombing is back. I actually do miss that occasionally. Because it can be used for some nice puzzles. Let's go! Yeah, pretty simple level. Dun 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 dun. Woo! This game is a lot of fun, I will say. This is also like the very first Let's Play that I have seen that is like in English. I literally cannot find an English Let's Play of this. Alright, time to go down to the second area now. As you can see, we're in the second column. Just block. This should be easy. The levels at the beginning are very boring, but they do quickly pick up. The difficulty curve in this is a lot uh, steeper than in the other Lemmings games. Let's go. Also, the, in this, the hatches already can go either left or right. Kind of like in Neo Linux. Also, in this, Lemmings can uh, move on top of Walker's heads, so you can literally make like a tower of Walker's. Yeah, pretty simple. Oh, and this also introduces the nuke button. Woo! Level completed! It's level completed! Uh, this'll get infuriating pretty fast, though. Just build. Oh man, the loading times. They are not normally this bad. On my old, 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 old computer, it's way faster. Let's go. Oh yes! I really do love the Lemmings Revolution music. Yippee, 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 yippee,
at least we can admire the architecture. Level completed, it is level completed, and we're gonna get tired of seeing this. Maybe. Time? Yeah, now we're on Just Dig. <laughs> Just Dig is like level 10 almost. Or level 3, depending on how you play the game. I'm gonna try going in, like, from down, then right, then down, down, basically. Everybody, go to the exit. Oh, everyone's already out. Yeah, I'm sure you guys aren't believing me when I say Lemmy's Revolution is really hard. Oh, it gets really hard. Alright. Introducing Water Lemmings. Alright, here's where it starts getting a bit interesting. Because this introduces a whole new type of lemmings. Water lemmings. They can walk on top of water. This also introduces levers. So basically if a lemming walks into a lever, stuff happens. Exactly what happens, uh, uh, you don't really know until you push the lever. But in this case, it causes water to fill up in these tanks. Thankfully, I don't think lemmings can actually splat on top of liquids, which is very nice. Also, for some tanks, they'll walk on the surface even when the liquid is, uh, filling up. And then that'll make this, this water fill up. So that's a- that is a very nice introduction to the water lemming gimmick. Water lemmings do appear- oh my gosh, the nuke button is so hard to use sometimes. There's one more type of lemming, acid lemmings, that we aren't going to see until later on. They can walk on top of green acid. Block and bomb! And, yeah. Original lemmings stopped at block and bomb, but this has a lot of other stuff like bash and dig, stuff like that. Gets kind of boring. Oh, I hope they don't splat. They are. Better try that level again. Man, it takes forever to load even when you're just retrying it. That's gonna be annoying. Alright, they should not squat from that last part. Actually, no, they can't. Even if I bombed them, it wouldn't matter anyways. Oh my gosh, the nuke button is so hard to use in this. You have to click it like eight times. And man, the lemmings are fat in this, I just realized. Probably because they haven't been, uh doing levels for a while. Bash in mine.
Not exactly one that I would uh, choose to do, but all right. This could be interesting. Let's go. Oh, water mummies are back. Yeah, this far we haven't really been using the whole cylinder gimmick yet. So there are tons of different solutions for this level. You just gotta use the one-way arrows to your advantage. I also wish there was a fast forward hot key for this, but no, you literally have to hold the click button on the speed up uh, sign. Totally stormed that level, yeah. Sometimes up, sometimes down. I forgot this level was this early in the game. This introduces a very big gimmick to Lemmings Revolution. And a gimmick I personally think should come to Neo Lemmings. Come on. The anti-gravity pads. Let's go. What they do is pretty much exactly what you'd expect them to do. Makes the lemmings walk on the ceiling. And now we've got regular lemmings and water lemmings mixed. This is a really cool level. I very much like it. Seriously, this level is amazing. Yeah, only regular lemmings can enter the blue balloons. Only water lemmings can enter the yellow, uh, the white balloons. I mean, seriously, that fin in the middle just looks so awesome. Well, we still completely dominated that level. I forgot that was so early in the game. Because we're still not done. We're on Bash and Dig now. We're still on the tutorial levels. It basically, it's like, once you exit the tutorial levels, VOOM! Super hard. Kind of like Oh No More, I mean, not quite to that extent, though. I actually really like this level, though. Ooh! Rare music. This does not play very often. That's what Pablo does. Very simple level, but I actually really like this for some reason. Actually, a lot of these Lemmings Revolution levels could be remade in Neo MX, but a lot of them can't, like the levels with the anti-gravity pads or the levers or the water lemmings. Admittedly, that level can be a bit fallen and tedious, though. But it still looks nice and cool. Alright. Float and climb. <sighs> yeah. Like I've said, this video is basically going to take care of all the tutorial levels, and it'll be pretty boring. But then after that, it should get much more exciting. Let's go.
the music in this is just so catchy. Alright, build and block. Oh boy. This is an annoying one. Come on! Ah, oh, the loading screen! Yeah. This level's irritating. Um... Thanks for building, dude. I was very specifically telling you to build, can you? Oh, you can assign skills while paused. Excellent. Kinda bummed that it cuts out the music, but... Alright. Yeah, this level just, it's a bit, that is not what I wanted to do at all. No, what? I had this problem in my Lemmings Let's Play as well. Come on. Okay, it's really dumb how it cuts out the music when you pause the game. This is going to mean a lot of the game is not going to have music. Hopefully, that should be it. And man, that level is just not very fun, I've noticed. Oh my gosh, that nuke button! Oh well. Woot! We got time for a few more levels, I think. Seafood star- actually? Never mind, this is starting- uh, we have now officially finished with the tutorial levels. So, you know what, I'll try seafood sarny. Just to show you what the rest of the game is probably going to be like. Because I believe this introduces the, uh, the, 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 introduces the crab trap. Come on. Oh, and this introduces laser gates. They're, they're like switches, except switches can be pushed more than once, whereas laser gates, once you push them, uh, they're just gone forever. So let's see what this does. So that laser gate is draining the water. You still don't want to go down there, though, because that crab is going to cut your lemmings open. Also, I'm not sure if this is actually true, but it certainly feels like in this, uh, falling on steel makes you splat way easier than falling on non-steel. Okay, wow. It is selecting lemmings to do certain tasks, it can be very hard, even if you're highlighting them.
Yep, that's seafood, Sarnie. I love my some seafood. Actually, I don't. I do not like seafood at all. I really don't. All right, that seems like a good spot to end the video. We have cleared a ton of levels. Don't get used to seeing that many green levels completed in this episode. So thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie, and I hope to see you for the next episode of Lemmings Revolution, where the game actually will start getting exciting. Have a great day, and God bless.